Welcome to the Rink Report presented by Telhio Credit Union ahead of tonight's matchup against the Minnesota Wild. It is Kids Take Overnight presented by COSI, so let's focus on the kids. Their last time out, the Blue Jackets' young stars shine very bright. They helped to knock off the Buffalo Sabres 6-4 to and improve to 2-2 two and two on the season. Kirill Marchenko and Igor Chinikov both scored goals, as did Adam Fantilli. Marchenko and Chinikov are tied for the team lead with six points, and Fantilli is heating up two goals in his last three games. They need to keep it up because the Blue Jackets will be without Kent Johnson. He suffered an upper body injury against Buffalo and will not play tonight. A player who is in the lineup tonight, 20-year-old defenseman David Juracek. He'll make his season debut and says he's ready to go. I try my best. You know, I, I, I'm, I'm just trying to play my game. And uh, my game is to jump, jump to the play and then uh, be, be offensive guy. So I'm just, I'm, I, I want to like put up some points too. So uh, I'm just want to be involved. So uh, it's, it's, it's good for me right now. This is the second and final meeting between the Blue Jackets and the Wild this season. Minnesota got the best of the CBJ 3-2 in their season opener, but afterwards the Blue Jackets talked about it and said they loved the way that they played. That means they'd be more than happy to get some revenge on home ice tonight. Here to tell you just how they can do it is the new TV voice of the Blue Jackets, Steve Mears. Okay, Dylan, thanks very much. It's time for your recipe for success presented by Marzetti. Key number one tonight for the Blue Jackets, got to stay out of the penalty box. The Minnesota Wild, the seventh best power play in the NHL, very underrated, and they did score a power play goal the last time we saw this matchup back on October 10. So discipline, staying out of the box is key number one. Key number two, score the first goal again, something the Jackets have done the last three games. Get off to a good start, get the crowd going. The only time this season where they didn't score first, was that first game of the year against the Minnesota Wild, that 3-2 loss on opening night. Third key for the night, it is a team effort. It's got to be, and it has been so far for the Blue Jackets. Got to keep that going. Yes, there are injuries, but it is the next man up. Blue Jackets so far this season with 11 different goal scorers. The league high is 12, so they've had a lot of different contributors. Certainly did the other night against the Buffalo Sabres with six different goal scorers. All hands on deck tonight against a very tough Minnesota Wild team. There you go. There you have it for your recipe for success presented by Marzetti. Here are tonight's pregame odds brought to you by Fanatic Sportsbook. The Blue Jackets are underdogs to win outright on the money line at plus 145. To cover a one and a half goal puck line, they're minus 160, and the over under tonight is set at six and a half goals. Next up for the Blue Jackets, it's their first meeting with the Toronto Maple Leafs this season. Then a quick stop in Nashville before they come home to Columbus to battle Connor McDavid and the Edmonton Oilers. You can watch all of those games on FanDuel Sports Network. Tonight, though, the Blue Jackets' focus is on a victory against the Minnesota Wild. That'll do it for the Rink Report presented by Telhio Credit Union. I'm Dylan Tyre saying enjoy the game.